Yeah, 2007. Yeah, 2007. We first met at uh, Trans Energy. We were talking on MSM before, but we first saw each other on Trans Energy. After that, um, we hang out a lot. We start hanging out, and uh, maybe after a couple of months, we start making our first track. <coughs> in the summer. In the summer, it was. Yeah. But we first met on Trans Energy. So if you didn't go to Trans Energy, there was no W and W. Well, we never really planned it. It just sort of started happening. We were just we went to a, a party, a state of trance, three hundred, in Dambos, and after that, we went home and we just started producing something, and then uh, our first track, Mustang, rolled out of that. Yeah. So. It took us two months or something to uh, finish it, but it was our first project together, and it worked out really well. Um, we complement each other really well. Yeah, exactly. He's good in the things I'm lacking, and the other way around. So that's why we are a perfect team. And we can do more things at the same time as well. Yeah, we, producing, we, have, you know. we have two computers in our, uh, in our studio, and when one's working on, the, on one computer, the other person's working on the other computer. So yeah. it goes, goes the, faster. The IDs are going so fast. When, when he's doing something, I get another ID. And then afterwards, and then the track, all the elements are in there in an hour or something, and then we only have to work it out. So it goes really fast. We've finished a lot of new tracks, and we're saving some of them exclusively for Trans Energy. We're going to test it out there. And we have one, one exclusive remix we did for one of the older anthems of Trans Energy. And we're going to save it, of course, for Trans Energy. We did it with uh, our friend Jonas Stenberg. It's one of the older anthems, so if you're curious, come see us. Yeah. Exactly. Mm. Trans, yeah. Good one. Yeah, really a good one. Well, wasn't to have that one. <laughs> I, I think I think trans in general is, um, it, it's it's more a, a feeling than than music itself. I agree. Um, it, it of course it, had, it normally has a lot of melodies in there, and um, it has a certain BPM, but. It, it, it doesn't have that, ma that much limits, I think. So, I, I don't really know. And our trance is, of course, a little bit different. We have, like, we, we aren't that melodic. Of course, we use melodies, but mostly use, like, the more banging sounds. And we, we try to, to get more groove in trance as well. So, a, slow, uh, a slower BPM and more groovy percussion, a little bit more techy as well. And sometimes we use a really like a melodic break or melodic monologic theme, but mostly it's more like a catchy, catchy hook line or something. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, because we just started like two, three years ago or something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Three years ago we had a, our first production. Yeah. And our first gig was nine months ago. Yeah, nine months ago. So. Nine months ago. And then they select, uh, of course, 20 DJs, and people had to vote. Um, for their favorite ones, and uh, we came out to be one of the last eight or something. Yeah, one of the, the higher ones. We were really, really happy. We didn't expect it, to be honest, because we saw a lot of like uplifting names in there. We thought, okay, we're not going to make it, so we were really happy. So yeah. we want to thank you all for voting for us. <laughs> Definitely. No, we sometimes read it, read yeah. it on the forums, and check it out, what they're writing and stuff. We aren't on the forum uh, ourselves. No, we, we, no. we don't post ourselves. But we sometimes uh, read reviews on, on current tracks. And um, we audience. follow ra radio shows on there as well. Yeah. And what they say about our tunes. Yeah. When they're flaming our tunes or something. <laughs> <laughs> and we always uh, look that up. Yeah, we just started our, our own uh, radio show on After Hours FM. And uh, it was first uh, monthly. But now it's bi-weekly. So we get one hour more a month. And um, yeah, it's a radio show. Um, we try to give the, the audience more tunes and the, the newest tunes. So we would try to play like tunes nobody knows. So they can always find something new in the show. And we have a special feature called Main Stage ID. That's where we pick one, one tune like nobody played. So we can't name it yet because it's too new. And um, we, we pick the best one of the newer tunes we get in. So that's the bit of the, the concept of the radio show, to, to bring the, the audience uh, the newest music. Yeah, and, and, and broad. More, more music as well. It's huge. Yeah. It's, it's, it's really big. It's, it's awesome. It's, 
maybe the biggest trans event in the world. Yeah, I think so. It's just uh, everybody. Every, everybody's looking at trans energy all about all around the world. Everywhere you come, people know trans energy. Yeah, everybody's talking about trans energy. Exactly. Every trans fan wants to go to trans energy. You have to go to trans energy. Yeah. Oh, every year since I was 17 or something. So it was illegal when I <laughs> went in there first, but I went every year from, from then. Yeah, I think I've been there for three years now. Yeah, three or four years already. Yeah, it was good. Yeah, definitely. It was, uh, I think, one of the best gigs um, I ever did. Yeah, it was good. Yeah, we always try to, to make something new and we always get inspiration from different kind of, kinds of music. So we try to, to make something new as well and try to combine a lot of styles. And after like, we made one tune, we were a little bit bored of it and we try to sometimes try to make the same kind of tune but totally with different elements. Yeah, exactly. So always try to improve, improve, even with our sound, we try to improve it. Like every tune needs to be better, better sound wise. ID-wise as well. Yeah, just in every aspect has to be better. And, and our arrangements are different than most of the trends. Yeah, we, we keep them really. We try to keep them really interesting. Yeah. Like every, for example, two seconds, there has to happen something really yeah. small that normal people won't notice. But if you listen to it in a, a lot of edits, a lot of stuff yeah. happening, a lot of automation going, a lot of things moving, yeah. so it gets like really energetic. Yeah. yeah.